videos. Hello! Welcome to Crafty Illust Creations. How are you? And we are on. Um, hi. Welcome to Crafty Illust Creations. How are you? Just come in and say hey. How is everybody? Just say hey as you come in, just so uh, I'll know who's watching and tell me where you're from. Hey Pearl, I gotta look at my comments. Oh, hi. Hey Pearl, welcome. Hello, Alana. Uh, I'm looking down over here, looking at my comments on my tablet because those little prints over there I can read really good. All right, it's been a while I've been on, so. Um, if I mess up, it's okay, it's alive. <laughs> so again, I'd like to welcome you all for joining me. Um, hey Ruth, hi, welcome. Hi Tony from New Jersey, welcome. Like it's, I said, it's been a while, it's been a month ago, over a month ago that I went on a live. So uh, I'm a little bit shaky, a little nervous, but I'll be all right. And um, Today, uh, I'll, ma I'll be making a flower, like uh, I haven't made anything for my door for St. Patrick's Day. So I'll be making uh, a wreath on a UITC board. I already started a um, large board. And uh, also I purchased this sign from Unique in the Creek as well. It's backwards, I'm sorry. Hi, Tony. Oh, I said hi to you already. So I'd like to welcome you all for coming on in and saying hey. Um, hey Luann, how are you? How is everyone? It's been a long time, friends. Welcome, welcome, come on in. So again, I'll be making a flower, like a, like a, you know, the center will be this one right here with uh, black, green, and gold mess I'll be using. I'll be sewing uh, the petal that I'll be doing throughout. So I did make some, but I'll be make I'll be doing a Star Trek petal, right? I think that's what that's called. That's what I'll be doing. So uh, this will take a while because it's been, I haven't made a Star Trek flower before. This is my first time, but I did the. Uh, did use the star truck pedal. Oh, I'm sorry. I was I didn't mean to um, sew those off. <laughs> no, yeah. Actually, those are the um, probably the only ones I got. There's some on the table, but thanks to Luann and all the uh, nice people that I purchased from in Canada and also some in the U.S. Right. I know, right? Uh, I'm just trying this out. I seen uh, Marla's uh, stuff. Hi, Meredith. Welcome. Meredith, uh, not Meredith, but um, who is it? Marla. I seen Marla's, uh, you know, Star Trek uh, petal flowers that she did, and I wanted to give it a try. This does take a long time to make because I'm like doing um, shared holes, but I did most of the uh, petals already, so we'll just get started right now so i won't keep you all so again i'd like to welcome you all for coming in sorry i think my camera is crooked whoa i turned off my camera sorry about that <laughs> as i was lowering it down I, it turned off i accidentally pressed that uh you know that little button on the side there i'm sorry hi sarla welcome Again, I, I'd like to uh, welcome you all for coming in. If you have any questions throughout, just go ahead and ask me. This is a sign I'll be putting in the center. It's an eight inch, I believe it's an eight inch. Oh, um, yeah, it's an eight inch round sign that I got from Unique in the Creek. 
All right, so I'll show you uh, the pedal fold. And if you have any questions or if you want me to slow down on what I'm doing, you can, you can always tell me. So, okay, so this is a 10, 10 by 10 cut mesh, right? 10 by 10, curl side up, turn it into a diamond. Okay. Black doesn't so good on the gray, I don't think, but make sure your edges are, it, they can be lined up perfectly, but you can do that as best you can to uh, make this triangle shape. Okay, flatten that out. And I take this and then put it over to this end. Okay, or, or the other way, doesn't matter. And you get that Star Trek shape, I guess. Got my bunnies and ribbon, thanks. Yeah, I got bunny butts too. I didn't, I don't have time making those yet. So, so we turn that this way. And I scrunched it here. And then I left this side up here. I hope you guys get a good view of this. This like that, right? It's a black, but it's black, so not so pretty good. So this side goes up like that too, and you get that shape. See, it sews better here. <laughs> See, I gotta check out my comments on this side to see. Okay, so what I do here now is I try to uh, pe have them, uh, you know, all the same size. So, but this one is a little, it's too small. So I'm going to redo this one. Okay. Okay. I think I, 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 uh, I cut this, so. Cut this about around six inches. I need my scissors. I'll sew you. So six inches is right here. So my scissors is a little dull. Okay, so that's six inches. So they're all that's that that length. I'm trying to be not perfect, but to make sure that they're all the same size, right? When you put them in the, into the board. So I leave about a th thumb's width into the zip tie and I zip it up real tight like. I need my cutters, sorry. So we have any questions throughout Go ahead and ask me. I meant to um, plug in my glue gun, but I forgot, but I need to do that because I, when I do the seared holes like this one right here, look, this one, this is the seared holes right here. I need to put glue on that one, on top of that one, just to hold it in, in there, just so it won't slip out. Yeah, yeah. I'll go get my extension cord. Hold on. It's just up down here. It slipped through the table. So... Oh, oh my gosh. I knew that would happen. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm having to trouble with my, what do you call it, my, my tripod here. My kids have been playing with it. <laughs> I'm sorry, it took you guys for a ride there, sorry. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, my glue gun. I need to plug this in. I'm sorry about that, guys. Hi, Kathy from Texas. How are you? Thanks for joining me. My, um, just now there, my, tri my tripod, um, 
fell to the table. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. Sorry. And my, my board went, went into the floor. All right, so we'll start that again. I'm sorry, you guys. So I did go ahead and uh, preload all the zip ties so you guys won't be in, you know, here with me that long because this this will take a while this flower to do I'm from hi Thelma how are you hi Sarmaine Nova Scotia Canada wow welcome 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 all right so I'm just gonna go ahead and slip in the uh ready-made petals here just cause if you need, I'll be making more petals throughout all right so it'll go faster here see I'm looking down at the my comments over here on my tablet so if you see me looking down that's what I'm looking at sorry if I took you off for a ride there when my tripod fell down <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> You know lives anything can happen in our lives so I just I just never thought it could happen to me so again a thumbs width into the uh, zip tie so I'll glue down the petals that are that I'm using as serred holes right See, I don't know how many petals I should, I should be, I'm pretty sure that um, the second circumference here, I'll use 32 petals. I know that. So I did cut 32 black mesh and, okay. And the next row, on the third row, I think I'll put, there's there's eight, right? 16, that's what I'm thinking. So I hope I'm right. So again, if you have any questions throughout, just go ahead and ask me. And if I seem a little jittery, it's been a while I went on live, so I'm a little bit nervous, but I'll be all right. You know, my kids, I always have my tripod set up just right, right for my lives. And then um, my kids, I got, I got like, how many kids? Um, five at home. So they take my tripod and use it for their uh, TikTok videos or their YouTube videos. So so they mess, mess up my tripod here. <laughs> I better get another one <laughs> just because um, they can have this one and I can have a better one, I hope, because this one keeps falling down. It's actually not the first time this happened to me here. But see, are you guys seeing this all right? I hope so, because <clears throat> yeah. That's what uh, that's what my kids do. So again, I'm doing shared holes on circumference two. Get those in there, thumbs width. Actually, I'm missing this one here. <laughs> there, there we go. That's better. So how are you guys? Whoops. Hold on, my, I gotta look here again. Something went wrong on my tablet. Oh, here we go. There we go. There I am. So I'm sorry if I go, if I go um, a little bit fast here, but I'll be making more petals again. I'm just putting these in. 
the ready-made ones in first and then I'll do more petals with you guys this again this petal is called um, um, a Star Trek petal oops I gotta cut that cut that uh, two inches of uh, tail off that's what I did Mm hmm so how is everyone how's everyone doing today I know what I'm gonna do when I get off here I gotta I gotta delete that part where I where my tripod um fell over <laughs> I don't want to Oh, I'm gonna have such a big good laugh when I look at oh, rewatch my yeah uh, live there. I just I'm just cutting the uh the zip tie tails off as I go because uh they go in my way when I I usually cut them after I got get everything in there but this way I'll they won't be in the way when I put in the next petal right. My glue gun is turned low, so make sure when you uh, I make sure when I um glue down my petals, I use a little low temp glue gun because I I I first time I glued down my petals, I um use a high temp glue gun, and you know what the zip tie um got loose. It melted and it got loose and the petal fell off. And I don't want that to happen, so I'm using a low temp glue gun here now, so. Yeah. Oh, goodness. I said, I said that, uh, hey, welcome. For, the, for those of you that are just joining, my name's Elizabeth. Um, you're on the Craft Illustrations page, and I'm doing a Star Trek uh, petal themed flower, like a happy St. Patrick's Day um, center in the middle. Um, from Unique in the Creek. This board is also from Unique in the Creek. So, I need something for my door, so. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't uh, make anything for my door yet, so. For St. Patrick's Day, so that's it's due. It's due. It's time to make one. So I thought I'd come on live, show you what I, what I've been up to, and chat with you for a while, right? To see how y'all doing. Friends from all over. So there's 32 petals all the way around. Um, this is this board is um, actually I'm using an old the old version of the board from Unique in the Creek. I still have quite a few of them. I need to uh, you know use up so I can start using the newer versions. So I still need to uh, start doing more reads because I hope that looks circular. See, that's how it looks so far. It's like an Indian headdress too, right? <laughs> Something I should try to make, because I know there's a a petal a a, a petal uh, called the uh, feather petal out there, but I think you need to purchase the tutorial for that petal. I was going to look into that. Hey, Susan, welcome. How are you? Welcome, you guys. I'm so happy you guys can join me, guys and gals. I, I said uh, it's been uh, a month ago, I think, over a month ago that I went on a live. So I'll be making uh, petals here with you. Um, one... Ten, ten petals. Ten petals. 
so I hope I have 10 mesh here. One, two, three. So you need the metal metal clips I use for when I uh, pre-make my petals. Okay, again, just watch what I did. Hi. So curve side up, uh, turn it into a diamond, fold it down like this, turn it sideways. Okay, make sure you try to line them up as best you can. All right, so this one goes over here. Okay, you get that shape. Okay, it's like a Star Trek pedal. I think that's why they called this the Star Trek pedal because of this shape here. And then I scrunch it here in the middle, right? And turn this over towards the middle, right? And this one goes to the middle as well. Get that shape. So now here you can mold your petal like that. And put your pin in there. Okay. Thanks for blessing the peds. Oh, I forgot to ask you that. Thanks for blessing me, all right? The Star Trek pedal. And that's, I think that, that pedal is pretty. I, don't, I like that pedal. I've made, I've used that um, pedal on the cro crosses, UITC crosses, and they looked so good. All right. That's it. Going off camera here, I think. Okay. Scrunch it right there in the middle. And turn this over like that. Excuse me. And this over this way. And you get the shape of the Star Trek pedal. Mm hmm. need more okay if I go a little faster here you guys can ask me to go a little slower because I'd be making lots of these anyways I didn't I didn't make I didn't pre-make any for the gold I made some for the green but this this um flower will take a while to make and I need to go a little faster so I won't keep you guys here too long the Star Trek pedal so what you guys been up to how is everybody hope everyone's being safe and enjoying their uh, themselves even though most some of us are on lockdown but have to try to make the most of it with your family because you get to spend your time with your family. Well, some of us. You guys, um, how's the picture? Whoops. Can't have that in there. It looks good on my end over here. So there we go. Need to, to make two more black. I think my pedal, my one, my board um fell out, fell over the table here when my tripod fell off. My board sl slid from the table and that pedal there. It it came off from the zip tie. And um, I need to remake that one. I'll show you how you can make, you remake. 
a petal that you already made. Hold on. So this is how it looks like. <laughs> That's how it looks like when it fell off the table. So um, what you do is try to make it work. See. See, you still get that shape. And this is where I scrunched it and I lifted it. Actually, no, this is where I folded it, scrunched it. So you can still remake even though you cut it. Okay. All right, so we're gonna put those in there now. Okay. So six inches, that's where I cut off the tails. This is six inches long again. So I'm just gonna put it in the zip ties. Or was it this way I was going? I think it was this way I was going. Okay, am I off camera? Sorry. So again, look, if you have questions throughout, you can ask me. Okay. I can't have the zip ties in the zip ties. That's no, no good. How are you guys saying something? Because I'm not seeing comments. Hold on. Whoa. Okay. On with this. In six inches. I chose six inches. You can go a little longer with this, but I, I think six inch long um, pedal is, is good. This one is a little hard to use. What's this cord doing here? Okay. In six inches. All right. Oh, I almost threw the the pin in the garbage. <laughs> already this is like uh, 22 inches wide so this is a big flower I hope it'll fit on my door but I think it will oh I can't wait to put the green in there now green is the next color so I'll figure out what I'm gonna do in between these here the because there's eight on the third row. We'll see what I can do. I think we need to uh, double up on some of those zip ties. Which I'll show you here in a minute. good scissors to uh, cut my uh, mesh because um, I think that my that scissors is getting dull anyway so it's supposed to be my ribbon scissors but it's getting dull so I need new scissors no to self new scissors maybe three of them <laughs> mm -hmm. getting caught in the zip ties myself here so what are you guys saying? I can't see anything, so cause, are you guys saying anything? Um, hello, Thelma. I think I said hello, Susan, okay. Nope. 
I think you guys are just watching. That's good. All right, that's the last petal for black. It's the only black I'll be putting on there for this uh, flower. So this is where I said I was going to put glue on the serrated holes. These are the serrated holes. These are the main holes right here, the smaller ones. The serrated holes would be the, this, the long one there. Serrated holes, okay? So that's where I'll be putting some glue on in every one just because the petal won't slip out, which it did when <laughs> my uh, board. I'm just going to run it through over, over the, the petal. When my board fell off the table, I was going to say. So only the seared holes, I'm putting the, zip, the, uh, the glue for extra, extra hold. So with the new boards, you don't, you don't need to do this because um, there's holes in the middle of all the uh, the ready the, the holes that are there I like um, there's more holes added on the new board and you don't need to use glue I don't think need more glue um so yeah but like I said I'm just trying to uh, use up all of my older version boards just because there we go that should be good enough so let that dry for a little bit so on with the uh, screw strings everywhere now with the second color now which is green so again we'll make a few petals glue strings everywhere I don't know how many I'll need for that. We'll see how much I cover up the board. So again, curve side up, turn it into a diamond, fold it over, turn it sideways, make sure you line it a little bit better than it is right now. And fold this over over here. Okay, that's it. And I scrunch it in the middle, like that. And I fold this over on this side, and this over on that side, towards the middle. And you get that shape. Okay. Hey, Marla, there she is. How are you? That's okay, you're not late. <clears throat> I was just talking about you, girl. I was just saying that I seen Marla's uh, pictures of her beautiful work that she did um, using Star Trek petal and making flowers. So this is what I'm doing here today with uh, colors black, green, and gold. It's a St. Patrick's Day themed kind of flower. So glad you can make it. Happy to have you all here with me. So if you think I'm going a little too too uh, too fast for you, you can uh, always let me know, and I'll go a little fast, uh, slower, <laughs> not faster. <laughs> That's silly. So I'm sure, but I'm sure most of you know how to f do the Star Trek pedal, or you've seen somebody do it before. Mm hmm. No notifications. Yeah, that's happened to me on somebody's live today, too. I checked the notifications and they were turned off when I was wondering why. It was a Amy Rose Crafts. I, um, I watched her this afternoon there and this morning. This morning for us. And my, my live notifications were turned off. So, yeah. Maybe it's because I've been I haven't been on live for a while. Maybe that's why. I don't know. So it's, I was just saying that it's been was over a month now that I was on. And yeah, I was waiting for some supplies that I needed for uh, to do some of the projects that I 
plan to do on live so i'm still waiting on some uh on my supplies so it takes a while for for them to get here so by the time when when i ordered my uh valentine's day stuff in december right i ordered most of them then and they got here last month <laughs> And uh, uh, already Valentine's Day is over, right? But I'll save them for next year, I guess. Well, some of them came in, but not all of them. Not all that I needed. So, so that's how it is for us here for mail. So, yeah. So I gotta... Next year, I gotta use this year's supplies. I gotta stock up on uh stock up this year for next year right that's what i'll try to do next time yeah so i'm just making petals more petals here just because um, we just slip them in there it'll go a little faster when i slip in, them into the uh, zip ties I hope I don't need to cut more mess. I do have my uh, some of my mess waiting over here on the side. So if I need more uh, petals, I'll um, cut more mess. So, but we'll know here how many we, petals we need. But for the for the black there, I used 32 petals. So I'm thinking that I need 16 for the third row here. So this is 16 petals here this is the last one so we'll get everything going here so how is everybody doing today on this fine saturday poly burlap for this for this petal fold yes you can yes you can oh thank you marla for answering Okay, I'm glad Marla is here to help me out. She'll uh, probably let me know what I'm doing wrong here, how many petals I need, I hope. <laughs> so, again, here it is. So, already this, uh, this measured out to be 22 inches, just the black itself, right? And then we're doing the third row now, so I think I'll put, um, there's eight eight zip ties so i'm thinking i need like um shared holes for that but we'll see we shall see my friends we shall see so i'm cutting off a tail about two inches an uh, inch and a half or something so this measured out uh, the length of it is um six inches long Trying to cut all of them like that just um, because I want to be, you know, I want them to look all, all the same. So, yeah, we need to uh, do uh, shared holes here again, I think. So, I'll cut this off. Because if I put this in there, there's going to be a big gap right in there, right? Look a big gap in there so we do need more petals so i'll add zip ties as we go so like i said this is the first time i'm making a star truck petal themed flower so oh yeah because um the first one uh the first three i made uh i was checking checking last night right i was testing my petals out to see what looks good and all that and um oh that's gonna be probably fit two in there because this is what i'm doing here this is that big one that long you know shared holes these are the main ones right this is a longer one here so i think i need to put two in there we'll see let's see let's see so yeah 
All right. So I'm just going to slip this in there. Or maybe not. Hmm. Maybe one. Let's try one. See what it looks like. So again here, we need to put hot glue it down. Because we don't want the... Uh, this slip off right the zip tie that's a little harder to put now so I'll make it work <laughs> I'll make it work I should have used that uh, 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 newer version but I, I want to uh, you know use up all my older older boards because it's it's gonna be going on my door anyway so mm -hmm. hi Doris welcome first time watching wow thank you from South Florida hmm welcome friends I'm so glad you guys can join me and hop on in and say hey even for a few minutes it's so good to see you guys. It's been a long time since I came on and I'm just happy to be on again and to do my thing. I was getting too lazy, <laughs> not working on anything. Just ever since um, my job, um, I stopped subbing for my, uh, so on my job there a month ago. I've been uh, lazy at home, not doing anything, just relaxing and enjoying being at home and not have to worry about anything. So that's sort of a vacation. I even got off Facebook for a month, a couple of few weeks, just to, uh, you know, be with my uh, family and enjoy life without social media for a bit. And it helped. It really helped. Mind you, I missed it. I wanted to watch all those what lives, but sometimes you gotta take a little breather. Sometimes you have to. You have to just um, take a break from from the world. So I'm just adding zip ties in between the already, so I can do seared holes. This is a big gap, so I don't know about this. So if I put, Marla is the expert in uh, in these. So if, if I put the gold, will it cover the, yeah, it'll cover it. If not, I can always go back and change it. Cut off the zip tie and change it up. No biggie. Did it before. Hi, Danielle. Danielle's my stepdaughter. See, they're upstairs, her and her dad watching me there. So she's saying hey from upstairs my uh, nine-year-old stepdaughter. Or is it eight? I forget. <laughs> she's been, she's been talking about, she's been asking me in the future, like she's been asking if she can do a live with me. Like, she, she knows about ribbon already and mess and the colors to use and all that. And, and, um, I told, I told her that one day she, she will go on a live with me. <laughs> and she gets so excited. <laughs> I think she's going to be the future. Wreath maker in our family here. When my my uh, when my fingers um 
can't handle the zip ties anymore. <laughs> I hope she will be. <laughs> I'll just do the ordering and she'll do the wreath making. <laughs> yeah, I'm working out in my basement over here as always. So they're all upstairs being quiet. Watching a movie or maybe watching me, I don't know. Okay. So again, I need to go over all the uh, seared hull zip ties and with glue so it'll hold better. Then I'm cutting off about an inch and a half of the tails. I'm putting the Star Trek pedal into the zip tie about a thumb's width or a little bit more because I didn't cut too much because I'm just too scared to uh, for it to slip off of the zip tie. Okay, so I think this is gonna look good. Oof, I love green. Green is my favorite color. Whose favorite color is green up in here? Anybody? I love green, any shades of green. My basement, my my, uh, my living, my whole house is green. <laughs> yeah, that would be nice to have around our lives. Something different, right? And kids nowadays just love being on camera, right? They do. When I said my uh, tripod here is messed up, that's why I fell over. They use they use it for their uh, YouTube videos and their TikTok videos, and yeah. now I'm gonna have to get another one so they can play with this one. I'm thinking a better one, I guess, ones that won't fall over when you're going on live, right? <laughs> Things happen on lives. Unexpected things. You just have to laugh about it. Like I just did, because I don't get sigh easy. Not me. I just laugh about stuff. You just love to laugh. If you didn't already, if you want to tell your friends that I'm, I'm live or you want to tell them what I'm doing, you can go ahead and press that S button at the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> Saying that all nice like. <laughs> so, yeah. Again, just put the pedal in there, like so. This is gonna be so pretty. My first time making a Star Trek pedal flower and I seen Marla's, like I said, all her beautiful work and one day I'm gonna make that. I was just thinking to myself. And today is that one day finally making one. With the, uh, the sign that I got from Munich in a Creek. Um, so this sign, I'll show you again what sign I'm, make, I'm using here. Take a break for a little bit there. So that's the sign. Happy St. Patrick's Day. It's backwards, but something for the door. And this is what came in the, uh, the little, uh, what do you call these? cable mounts and the Chanel stem. Those also came with the, the sign. <clears throat> so it's an eight inch sign. I do have six inch signs as well for crosses. So but I'll, I'll make crosses here. Oops, I need to put zip ties in there. Here, sometime this week. 
I love to watch your lives. You have the sweetest personality. Oh, I tried. Thank you, Wanda. Thanks for floating my boat. Even in Northern Alberta, my boat is being floated. <laughs> Thanks, Marla. <laughs> Where there's no water, they're all frozen. Frozen. <laughs> frozen. <laughs> frozen. That's a, that's a different word. Yeah, I try, I, I, uh, when I come on, I try to be, uh, you know, you know, happy and to make people laugh. I love making people laugh. I just enjoy that. Um, like I said, I don't sigh easy. I love, um, only when my husband tells me he, he loves me is when I'm sigh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. Um, so, so six inches I'm cutting long. I'm keeping this whole thing here. So I'm cutting about um, about an inch and a half of the tail for the petal. Again, for those of you that are just joining, yeah, I just I just love making people laugh, and you know, <clears throat> it's just I guess these hard times that we're having. We just need more laughter in our life. Hi, Linda. How are you? Yeah. Thanks, Marla. So that's how that looks like with the green in the third circumference, the black and the green. So we'll put more green in there, I think. Or gold. So it's gonna be shared holes for the fourth row now which is which is oh i'm sorry i got it so second third uh fourth row so there's third holes again so we'll put one petal in there in each i think i'll put green in again because I, I love green <clears throat> so we need so there's eight zip ties that were already there when we added, we we put shared holes, so there's eight more, so 16 petals. So I have um, seven here, ready-made. So I need to cut, how many did I say, 16? I need to cut nine more green mesh. So. One zip tie, ah, one zip tie. <laughs> one one petal per zip tie is what I'm doing here. So, you see what happened in there? Look, I zipped this up, and then this zip tie went into the uh, the other zip tie. But that's okay. We'll just leave it like that. We won't fix it because it'll zip up good, I think. If not, I'll change it. Okay. Hmm. First time watcher, Linda. Hi, welcome. Yes, I haven't been on for a while now. I, I, it's been, uh, when was the last time I was on? I think it was January um, um, the 6th. January the 6th. Make sure your zip ties aren't, uh, you know, caught into the other one. Like I did with, oh, you know what I forgot? Oof, I forgot to, uh, you know, glue down these uh, shared hole petals here. I need to do that. I'm sorry. Here's some glue for us. So we won't slip away. So I'm going to be hanging this wreath outside at my uh, door, you know. Because there's nothing out there right now, and it's embarrassing. A wreather should have a wreath on their door all the time, right? I didn't have time to do this. So, I was waiting for that sign, too. So, again, I put some hot glue over the... Sorry. Glue spiders. Um, 
over the uh, third hole zip ties so the pedal won't slip out. That's what I just did. So keep going with the pedals. Yep. -er. So how is everybody? Are you guys bored or no? Oh, hi, Lucille. I'm good. How are you? Monanto. I'm good. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I think I need some water. I didn't bring down any water over here. Hint, hint to my hubby who's watching. Um, yeah. What did I do wrong there? I need to take off this one here. It's messing up the pedal that I just... So I'll just take that off. It's because it's messing up this pedal here. It's making it crooked, so... So that's fixed. So we need to add another zip tie in there because I cut that off. The one I just told you that we got caught into the other zip tie there. So again, adding another one here. All right. Not bored at all. Thank you, Marla. You missed something today, Marla. You missed my tripod um, falling off from uh, where it's standing here in, on my two two tubs. <laughs> There's two tubs, uh, you know, bins stacked on top of each other, right? That's where I'm sitting my uh, tripod. And then I was going to go get, um, what was it, my extension cord to plug up my, uh, plug in my uh, glue gun. And it tipped over. Um, yep, I pressed the go live button already. <laughs> and this happened. <laughs> I, I laughed about it. It's it, everything, you know, when you go live, you don't, you, you don't know what's going to happen. Uh, the unexpected happens. Something, uh, you say something wrong sometimes or you do something wrong or you forgot to say something. And, it's all right. It happens. This one is is too too small here. Whoa! See what I mean? I drop everything when I go live, and when I'm down here by myself working, everything went, went goes goes right. I don't know. Maybe it's because it's too quiet down here, because usually my kids are down here with me. <laughs> yeah, it tipped over, and then my board fell off, you know, slipped off the table. And there were like uh, four or five, th three or four petals on my uh, board already. I haven't started yet, so. And one of my petals slipped off. I didn't glue it down yet. <laughs> It was funny, but it's all right. It gave you guys a good laugh and a good, uh, you know, good travel there for a bit. So again here, so I need, what do I need? Let's count. So I need, am I counting right? One, two, yeah. So I need six, six more um, green. So we'll put this aside for now and we'll cut six, um, green. So I don't need, I, I'm not gonna use my thing there cause everything's on this side and I don't wanna mess anything up. So this is how I cut my mess as it, Hopefully, 10 inches, right? So I need six, I said. So two. Give me a good chance to get up. Okay. 
That's six. All right, let's make petals, shall we? I just changed the blade here yesterday. First time in two years I changed the blade. It wasn't dull, I just, just wanted to, I know, change it. Because it's been a long time my I haven't changed my blade. So again, curve side up, turn it into a diamond. Turn it this way, fold it that way. Okay, turn this over here. This is the Star Trek pedal, by the way. So you get that shape. Okay, and scrunch it right in the middle, like this. Right? And you turn this over over here, and this on this side. And you give it a little bit of shaping here. Right there. And that's the Star Trek panel, everybody. Sets a pretty petal to use on crosses and anything else that you would like to make. I won't explain because um, you probably watching is probably the best way to learn something rather than explaining and explaining over and over again. I get tired of myself listening to myself. <laughs> <clears throat> so as you go into the uh, the roll. In, in, into the inner roll, it, the mess gets curly. I had to flatten some of them for a bit overnight, but these ones I just, I just, the ones I just cut are a little bit curly. <clears throat> All right. Thank you, Marla. I hope so. So, lost some of the viewers, but that's okay. They'll come back and watch the replay to see how the flower turned out. That's what I usually do for some. <laughs> Oops, wrong way. So, I, I, I turned it this way. This is the way I've been doing it. Keep going the same way when you're folding your petal, because if you go on this way, it'll 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 go. This edge will go turn this way instead of this way, right? It's it won't look uh, as uh, uniformed and consistent on your on your board. So always, when you're doing a pedal, always fold it the same way, like your edges up here and down here manufactured edges, right? So this way, not this way. Okay. Okay, one more for the green and we'll put them into the zip tie, the board. Hi, Alma. Welcome, Alma. Welcome, welcome. So glad you guys can uh, come on in and say hey, even if it's, it's just for a minute. And so, so happy to have you. I know everybody's busy and all that, so everybody has to be places, watch somebody else. It's okay, you can always come back and watch the replay. It'll be on replay. It's all right. So again, I'm just sticking the pedal into the zip tie about a thumb's width into there, right? Okay. Um, why is this? Uh, okay. Oh, I get confused about my zip ties here for a bit. But where's my cutter? 
I know I'm losing stuff. So this about an inch, half an, an inch and a half of that tail cut off from the pedal, right? So it's, you'll get the, the pedals all the same, almost the same. Um, what do you call? Same um, look. All right. How long have I been on? What time is it right now? I don't have a time down here. I should have a clock down here. But when I'm down here, I don't need a clock. <laughs> Just, <laughs> I love to be down here and craft. That pedal is beautiful. I have seen it before, but I haven't tried making it yet. It is beautiful, Alma. I need to try it with different colors, too. It's the first time I'm I, I'm actually making a flower like this myself, but I, but I've uh, I did uh, use this petal before, but not just not like this, but I just enjoy seeing Marla's uh, you know pictures, and I uh, love her uh, wreaths of these kind of uh, you know this this kind of flower. Oh, and I just, I admired that, so I had to try it. It is a lot of work. You, you do need a lot of uh, pedals. But in the end, you'll, um, you'll probably love your work. So, no, I need two more green. Oh, shoot. I didn't count it right. So, we're almost done here, though. Almost done. Need to make... Need to cut two more green. Sorry, guys. I didn't count it right. I'm just... Learning as I go myself, because this is the first time I've made this sort of type of flower. And you're learning right along with me. And thank you for joining me. Thank you for being here this long. For all of you guys that are still here from the beginning. Thank you. I so enjoy your company. Love to see you. Love to be seen by you. Love to chat with you. Clip that up, get it ready for the zip tie. <laughs> 706 Eastern. Oh, that's 606 over here, I think. Mm -hmm. I noticed that, Myla. I love your flowers. Round red. Is that the pedal I have seen used for the round red? Round red. The round red. I don't know what, what that is. The round red. Okay. With this, with, with this pedal too, you don't have to worry about the phrase. Right? There's no fraying in the Star Trek pedal. So we'll add, we'll cut those off first, and then we'll add it. So, so about six inches tall. I'm keeping the uh, the petals. I figure that's a good size. I am located in northern Alberta. Okay. Northern Alberta. Oh, where's my cutter? There it is.
Northeastern. Um, um, I think I missed one. Yes, I did. Oh, no. Did one fall over? I have to look. Hold on. Yeah, I missed one. Oh, sucks. One more green. I'm sorry, you guys. I was just talking and enjoying your company and not not um paying attention to my flower. This is great. It's great. the last green here quickly and we'll just head on over with the gold so I need to fold the gold ones too I never I didn't fold the gold ones the gold because like I said I'm just learning as I go I don't know how many petals I need but now I know next time I make this type of flower and I hope you're enjoying this and learning right along with me. So I need to do shared holes for that too, right? So we'll need eight. I'll add four more zip ties for the middle, right? Or no? Um, why do I need one in there? Oh, I don't know. We'll just go ahead. We'll just do shared holes, and then I'm just thinking we might not need the gold, but I want the gold in there. What if maybe I just do a fluffy, like a like a, a ruffle in there instead of these gold ruffle in there? I wonder if I should um, put glue over the uh, shared hole ones for this one. Yeah, I should. If I put it out in the door and um, we live right right by a river, right? And there's open area in the backyard, just r river, the peace, mighty peace river. And oh, and the wind just blows and blows when it's storming, right? And one time, one time I put a wreath up in my door out in the front and the back both of them both both doors and they flow off from from uh, off my door so this way I can uh, be, be confident that um, this won't happen my pedals won't fly off my uh, board here when it it storms <laughs> so that's why I need that extra hold that ex extra glue in there right <clears throat> yeah just to be safe right and then one time uh, I put uh, what did I put on my door here in New Year's New Year's um, um, wreath and um, my husband walks in the door with a wreath and a uh, few ribbon some ribbon and my dog was just you know hopping on onto the wreath trying to grab it and he, he took off he took off the uh, the what do you call it? the ribbon from my wreath and I wasn't very happy about that but I fixed it and it went back on the door with the with some nails and or some uh, you know more attach attachment and it was okay all right Good story time for you guys there. <laughs> so let's do more folds here, shall we? Because I didn't make any, uh, you know, gray petals. So this way you learn more how um, I make the petals and, and uh, it'll, be, it'll be in your mind all evening. Okay, here we go. So we put eight in there. We need eight, right? So we won't make more than eight. I think this is more than eight. So again, curve side up, turn it into a diamond, fold it over this way, 
turn it sideways, take this end, put it on the other end, get that shape. I think gold sews better on camera. Turn it this way and scrunch it in the middle right there to get that sort of shape. And you take this, these here and put them like that, right? And you take the other side, put it up like that. And you can mold it up if you want. Or you can just leave it like that too. Or you can put it like that on a wreath or like this. Doesn't matter. It's up to you which one you want. All right. So that's what we're doing. So we, again, we need eight. So I'll go, I won't explain here now because you probably know what I'm doing. I love this petal. I think I'll use this petal on my cross, uh, my uh, um, Easter cross that I'll be making here pretty soon. I'm just waiting on my, uh, what do you, uh, those Easter lilies. I have some, I got some, but that's not enough. I need, I am still waiting on my floral, florals to come in. So I'll be making an Easter lily cross soon. Soonish. But I still, I still need to decide on what color I should use for for this petal. The purple or white or a little bit of both. That have to, I have to decide. So I was hoping I'd be on for about an hour and a half. I think it's almost an hour and a half. I've been on. But that's okay. I just been, it's just been a long time since I've been on and it's okay if I go on longer for my first one here because I like to, uh, you know, mingle with you guys and talk with you guys and, you know, share some stories of what happened and yeah, just to visit you. Because I miss Jess. It's actually a pretty good place to visit your friends if you want. You can do that as well. You can get to know each other if you want. You can, um, as long as we don't talk about the world and what's happening and, you know, um, as long as we're not talking about politics or we're just, just having fun and talking about, um, about our good, good lives in general. Six, two, four, six, two, so that's eight. So I made eight petals. I didn't even know I made eight because I was talking away. <laughs> so I'll cut these up again. My garbage can closer here. So this way we'll put the petals in a little faster. So. I'm not sure if we need um, petal, um, what do you call it? The petals will show when I put the sign on, but we'll see. Let's see what happens. It's an eight inch sign, and I think it'll cover up pretty much all this gold petals here, but we shall see what, ha what happens. Okay, so let's put in the uh, gold petals that we just made. Make sure your zip ties are not tangled with each other in there because it is a little bit um, crowded in there now with all those zip ties and tails in there. Oops, I measured it. I didn't even, oh, I didn't put one in there. Didn't put, so I'm just putting the uh, petals in there as a thumbs width again. 
somebody else's thumb though. This is my small thumb, but it's <laughs> I keep measuring it. <laughs> oh, this is so silly. I need to put one more in there. One more zip tie in there. So I'll do that right now. Okay. So any questions so far? Yeah, thanks. I did some last night. I was down here with my kiddos and, you know, visiting them. This is their, their room, their base, the basement over here. No, the zip tie is in there. I just caught it all tangled up with the other ones. Oh. I think it's best that you put the zip ties in as you go. I mean, I mean uh, the middle part here, because you don't need you don't need to uh, be getting all those zip ties tangled up um, into the other zip ties. Because <sighs> it'll it won't get it gets you mad, but it won't. It'll. Um, save you on time all right we're almost done oh my goodness this is gonna be so 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 pretty i was gonna say stinking cute but i don't want to say that because i don't know oh wow just like the one marla has <laughs> just kidding no way my my uh my first one looks like yours. Yours are a petal inside of a petal, right, Marla? Petal inside of a petal. How do you do that? How do you have time to do that? Gosh, it takes a lot of patience, girl. But this is turning out to be really, really, really pretty. Mind you, I, did, I didn't... um get my sign ready because I wasn't sure what I was going to do with it. I was going to put holes on either side because I don't really trust this mount. Even when um, I put um, E6000, I don't, I don't really want to use it. But I'll use pipe cleaners. But if you can, you can use it. Wow. I got to look at this. You got to see this. You got to see this. Ooh, that is so gorgeous. Look at that. I'm feeling lucky. How about you guys? Thank you, Marla. Mm -hmm. Now we need to attach that in there. Some people put them, um, some, some put them, um, uh, what do you call those round foam, foams at the bottom to uh, give this a bit of a, uh, you know, lift but i don't think i'll do that i'll just put i'll just um you know put um holes and i'll just use pipe cleaners and then that'll be that because that's that is mine so i'll use two of these here I do have a metal, metal punch now, right? Look! I just got this this week. It actually works like a charm. I think I'll put one up here and we'll put, no, I'll put one side to side. Side to side. Oh, I'm just so scared. There you go, side to side, and uh, make sure they're shame. Oh, you know what I forgot? My hanging zip tie. So this way, I'll know where the, uh, so this is the hanging holes right here. That's where I'll put the hanging zip tie. And right away. Keep it, give it, keep it, <laughs> give it a little bit of zip. Okay, so that's the top part. Don't forget, 
so this way my side won't be crooked, right? Because if it's crooked, I won't like it. But if you put it on crooked, it's fixable. I wonder if I should put it like that. Yeah. I'll do that. So I'm just putting on the uh, pipe cleaners on the sign. Right. Go in the hole, please. Okay. There we go. Give it some couple of twists. How many rows of the black and green did you use? I used 32 petals, uh, less than a roll of black, but it's always almost done. Where is it? This is what I had left when I finished with the black, right? There's two, 32 uh, 10 inch cuts. And then this is green, almost done too. So uh, how many did I do for green? I did 16, 32 as well, right? 32, 32. And then gold. I overcut, the, I didn't use much gold, see? I just, I just use eight, eight um, uh, cuts for the gold. So one roll of mesh for the black and the green. If you are uh, going to do, well, actually, for any roll, if you're going to do this. So I'm going to see where the uh, hanging, okay, here we go. All right, I'm just going to put the uh, pipe cleaners through the holes. I'll show you in the back when I'm done attaching the sign. Here's what I did, right? So be patient. This does take a while to get in there, but actually no, that's that that won't go in there. Hmm. On the on the third row, that's where the pipe cleaner should go. Because it is a wide sign, so yeah. All right, again. So attaching the signs is always tricky, but once you get them all in, it's beautiful. You get it in there. If you don't want to go in there, I'm just, I, I'm sorry. I talk to my wreaths when I make wreaths. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not mad or anything. <laughs> oh, and, and I, and, uh, and every time I sell a wreath, you know what I do? I kiss my wreath goodbye. <laughs> I get so attached to all of them. I don't know. I don't know. My 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 hubby thinks it's it's silly. Come on, help me out here. Don't make me make a scene. Okay. All right. It's gonna. Oh man, where is the hole? I'm sorry, you guys. I I ha I have trouble finding the right holes attach my signs and it takes a while but it'll do it I gotta finish you here you we're on live don't make, get me embarrassed here we go okay so we attach that there if it needs readjusting I'll readjust it here when I'm done when I'm off live so but right now I'm just attaching um, wherever no actually it's the right place I was gonna I, I said I was gonna attach so that's good that's good okay here we go all right I think when I go off the table I, I see the holes better okay so I need to stick this one in here now. Right? So are you guys bored with me here talking to myself? 
Okay. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do that. No, oh, here we go. Here we go. All right. Ha <laughs> ha. Trying to mess me up this sign here. How many rows? Uh, oh, I think I answered that. It's look, it looks, it looks, yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you, Lu Luann. All right. So there we go. Aha. There's the finished St. Patrick's wreath. If you take the sticky off the amount, the news gorilla. This tape to the pan works amazing when the sun sells it. Gorilla Two Face tape. Okay, thirty pound. All right, gotta go check that out. I put a thin pick up the hole. Oh, all right. Thank you, Marla. I shall remember that next time I do any of these flowers. Yeah. All right. Well, that's it, you guys. If you don't have any questions, thanks for the suggestions, um, Marla. I will look into that for sure. Thanks. Mm -hmm. So I love this flower. Isn't it pretty? Look at that. It measures up 22 inches, I said. Look at that. Whoa. I love it. I'll just hang it up here so you guys will have a better look. I hope my camera doesn't um doesn't tip over when when I lift you guys up. So you guys can have a better look at it on the wall, right? So I'm sorry if I tip over the camera. But I'm gonna have to lift it up so you guys can have a better look see. Here, hold on. Oh no, that's not gonna work. Oh no, that's not gonna work. I'll just, I'll just um, do it like this. <laughs> I just, I'm just lifting up the, uh, the tripod there. There we go. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? I love it. Oops. Sorry to make you guys dizzy. Thanks, Marla. Happy St. Patty's Day. That's actually black, green, and gold. It doesn't look good on camera. But, yeah. So that's it, you guys. That's all I got today. Hope I, hope I come on soon. And... So I can just, I'll just carry it here so you guys can look at it. See, I have my, my light so it looks better here. That's what I just made. So if you guys have any questions or whatever, whatever just um, go ahead and ask me. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Heather. Thank you, Sarmaine. Thanks, Ruth. Um, I don't know, Marla. Maybe for special occasions, I, I'd be I'll be making these because these these this is a big big um project. But it came out beautiful, so I enjoyed making it. I enjoyed my spending my time with you guys, and um, you know. I, um, especially the other ones that just drop by to say hello and, you know, spread the love for me. Um, thank you all for doing that. And, uh, you guys, um, if you don't have any questions, I'll just get off here and, uh, let you guys go and we'll see you again, uh, next time I go on. All right. Yes, it was good to see you and it was good to be seen by you. Thank you, guys. You guys have a good day. Have a blessed uh, weekend and have a good week. And we'll see you again soon. Bye.